Greetings and salutations. It is I, the Great Beyondo. <laughs> Today we are going to have a unveiling of Lego minifigures. <laughs> Well, uh, I only bought one, two, three, four, five, and, uh, yeah, so I hope they're the ones I want, because it would suck if they're not. So, uh, let's open one. I'm shutting my eyes, I'm just grabbing for anyone that happens to come here. Yeah, I'll just grab this one. Okay, so I don't have my scissors. I don't know where they went. So I guess I'll have to use my knife. I have no idea what this one was. Tell ya, it's wicked hard trying to figure out what these are. Oh yes! Alright, I was hoping this was going to be this one. I wanted the genie. So this is pretty cool here. We got our normal black stand. Let me push that so you can actually see that. Okay, we have our little genie tail there. We have a little magic lamp. We have the genie hat, which I kept confusing for the helmet that came with the space chick. And I was looking for this little adornment here that was going on top of the genie hat. So apparently that's a separate part, and here's his his uh, blue head. Apparently the genie is a blue man, or maybe he just blew himself. <laughs> so anyways, uh, I'm going to stick this on here. So it's kind of cool, he's got the little blue body, I mean, the blue genie, I think taking after uh, the genie from... Uh, what's that movie called? Aladdin. Aladdin. You know, Disney's Aladdin. With Robin Williams, the man of a million voices. <laughs> so this is pretty easy to put together here. I mean, he's got a nice little beard going on there. And, uh, you got the, the genie's turban hat. And I guess this, this little thing here, there's like a little hole that goes in here. I don't know how this actually works. Yeah, it's like a little pig. So you just gotta stick that in there. Yep. So the, the, the peg goes in here. And then you gotta stick the hat on the genie. And the genie comes out of the lamp. Oh yeah, I can do this. So the genie comes out of the lamp like that. So you put the lamp here. And then you put the genie, nope. I guess that's not going to do that, but still pretty cool. Or I suppose you could do this. Aha! Ha 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 ha! Look at that! So the genie looks like he's coming out of the lamp. Isn't that cool? Let me just fix his turban here. So that's cool, because I kind of wanted him. And, uh, see here. Because he was kind of, if you see the, the, the space chick here, she has a helmet. And actually, there's a lot of people that have kind of helmets. I mean, there's the, I don't know, the Spartan dude, and then there's the, the, the doctor dude. And that's all, like, hard stuff. A lot of people with hair. I suppose they all have hair. I don't know. I found this one to be very difficult to uh, decipher which one's which. So let me open another one here. I'm only going to do two. I'm going to delay the pleasure. That way I get more videos. So, uh... My eyes are closed, I swear. And e, e, my, e. Oh, okay. So, there's this one. And, I don't know, there haven't been any uh, cheat codes out lately. Usually by now there's a bunch of, like, cheat codes and all that stuff. You know. Okay, and this is... Yes! It is the alien! I tell you, I had a hell of a time trying to figure out which one this dude is. I mean, I guess the, the best way is, you know, trying to figure out who, who has the... Because he's the only one that doesn't have the normal Lego head. He has a special alien head. Like, if you see that right here. So, it's kind of 
it's not it's your, not your atypical Lego mini figurehead. And then yeah, I guess the other thing I was trying to look for was this blue, yeah, blue, uh, green uh, rod that's supposed to be his laser. So let's, he's got his little alien legs. He's got his little body. He's got some nice musculature sculpted on there. And then, uh, so really no other accessories, I guess, but he's got, but he, he's just a little, kind of the, your typical Roswell alien. So that's pretty cool, I guess. Uh, I don't know if there's a way for you to get a better look, but, yeah. So, anyways, there we go. How about that? Is that good? Is that the money? So yeah, this is the Roswell alien next to the genie, and oop, and uh, we got his little gun here, his little laser, and uh, that's pretty cool. Has a little rod, rod coming out of it, so it looks like he's shooting it. Kapow! 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 So neat. I'm uh, pleased. This is the. Uh, Probably one of the only ones that I want. Ah, hell, I want to open up another one. I spent f uh, like 15 minutes at Kmart. Uh, I have a clothes now. Which one? Me, 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 and the drum roll is, oh yes, Lady Liberty. <laughs> now this was a tough one. Oh man, it took me like five minutes to figure out that she also had the uh, triangular uh, type thing here. And uh, you know what gave it away finally was this thing here. It was the, the thingy, I, I guess the torch that will be the that you put the flame in. Cause I, I didn't know what the heck to look for. That's pretty cool. And this this piece here, it's a, it's a little soft. It's a little rubbery. So it's not your atypical, uh, I need a head here, don't I? That's not an open one. Oh, I do have, oh, here it is. I'm gonna go over here. So here's Lady Liberty. She's kind of got a warrior, you know, nice look on her. So, just uh, keep that in mind, this triangular piece here, because there's also the, uh, I don't know what you want to call her, there's the girl with the the fan, the, the geisha, I think she's a prostitute, she's a whore, she's a, so uh, yeah, so that took me like five minutes just to figure out, because I know I, I, I must have put like at least five or six of these back on the shelf. I mean, I'm going through the whole stack. I mean, there's probably like 50 of these things on the shelf. And, uh, I mean, not specifically Lady Liberty, but... So, anyways. Alright, cool. Let me get the, the head on here. Nice. Pretty, pretty uh, good design. As far as, uh, you know, detail sculpted and... Or, not sculpted, but you know what I mean. So then, uh, she's got the the torch here that she can carry. Goes right on the hand. Oh, beautiful, for spacious skies. Or, isn't that what they sing for Lady Liberty? That's pretty cool. And then she's got the little thing here, so... You know, if you ever had a little Lego New York, and what does this say? It says July 4th. M C I can't read that. But it says uh, 1776 in Roman numerals. See? 1776. Roman numerals. So anyways, this concludes our session for today. So we have an alien, a genie, and Lady Liberty. I hope you, uh, ladies and gentlemen, have found this session to be enjoyable and, uh, Look forward to our next meeting. Sayonara.